Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David and this is a deck review. In a world full of evil magicians, a young card master will bring them to justice. Introducing the world's first comic book series printed on a deck of playing cards. Magicians must die. We're going to look at the Magicians Must Die deck. This is uh, volume four. This is the fourth deck in a series. Uh, this deck was uh, produced from Hand Lords and it was illustrated by Jay Paterns. Now, if you don't know about the Magicians Must Die series, uh, the Magicians Must Die series is the world's first comic uh, book. It's the world's first comic series that's printed entirely on a deck of cards. Uh, this unique deck of cards, it's got custom Ace of Spades, it's got custom Jokers, and the backs, if you turn them all over and lay them out, they make this really giant sized poster sized comic. Now, the comic, uh, if you haven't read it, it's all about magicians and it's about playing card masters. It's all hand drawn and it's all inked by uh, Jay Paterns, and uh, it's produced, like I said, by Hand Lords. Now, now, if you don't remember Hand Lords, Hand Lords pretty much started card manipulation. Uh, way back in the day, it used to be called XCM, which was Extreme Card Manipulation. Now it's called Flourishing. Uh, it was started way back in 2001, uh, and so they are the ones uh, behind this really cool deck. Now, like I said, this is the fourth volume in a series, and so if you don't have one through three, uh, by the time you get to four, you might be a little lost. Uh, this would be a really cool deck to purchase in an uncut form. It would make a really cool uh, graphic to have framed on your wall. The tuck case is all just artwork uh, from the comic book and from the comic series. It says MMD, Magicians Must Die. It also has the uh, Hand Lords logo right there in the corner, and it says number four. Uh, this side says Magicians Must Die. This side says Comic Deck. Uh, here's some ad copy about Hand Lords, and on the top it says MMD, and then the uh, artwork graphic here is just art and graphic from the cards. All right, so that is pretty much it for the tuck case. Let's take a look at these cards. These cards were printed from the United States Playing Card Company, and they do come on their famous snappy retail stock. They do have air cushion finish, and they do have a modern and cut and if you'd like to learn more about stock cut or finish you can click the link below in the description now like I said earlier the back design each one's gonna be completely different uh, you can see it does have a gray border but each one is a panel or it's gonna be part of a panel that when assembled together will make this really cool hand illustrated comic book this deck comes with two identical jokers uh, the first of which is uh, just two beautiful girls uh, just hanging out uh, just looking pretty uh, and there's no uh, uh, coloring there. It's just an ink drawing and then the other Joker kind of looks like uh, the Green Goblin But it's just some sort of a specter holding a spear and as you can see the spear has kind of like maybe a diamond uh, Drawn out in blood on the spade tip. The ace of spades is a gentleman doing a back arched leap over a upside down spade pip and then throwing some cards. Uh, he could also be upside down, I guess, doing a flip. The pips and indice cards in this deck are all completely standard and easily recognizable. The core cards in this deck are all completely standard. Uh, however, they've been recolored uh, just to use the red and black of the comic series. Uh, you'll also notice that the pip there has been outlined in red, and so that's uh, pretty cool too. Your two extra cards are ad cards, uh, the first of which is a little ad card that tells you a little bit about the Magicians Must Die series. Uh, the second ad card is a layout, so it tells you exactly how to lay the cards out uh, so that you know how to put the comic book back in order just in case you shuffle them. All right, so that is my review of the Magicians Must Die Volume 4 comic book series deck of cards. Uh, this deck was provided very generously for us from Murphy's Magic Supplies, and if you'd like to purchase your own, you can find it at one of your favorite Murphy's Magic Suppliers. Thanks, bye.